Welcome back to the Art of Living Gallery. Multiple sclerosis affects the body's central nervous system. The symptoms can be mild, like numbness in the hands and feet, or severe, like paralysis or blindness. Because of MS, folk musician Bill Nash has trouble getting around these days, but he finds it's always worthwhile when you make the effort for music. Well, my babe was out on Central Expressway and she got a flat tire. Yes, my baby was out on Central Expressway and she had a flat tire. Well, she called me on the telephone and said, here's my one desire. Well, I was feeling so remorseful. I'm not clear what I'm going to do. You can't think of Dallas music without thinking of Bill Nash. He has been a shaping force in this local scene. I really don't think he has any idea how many people that his music has touched and what an inspiration he is for so many of us. I really don't think he, he even has any idea. I was diagnosed with MS in 1989, multiple sclerosis for those who don't know what MS means. Yeah, I went through all the phases of grief that everybody goes through, but for me, it was interesting because I never really got to do denial. I ended up helping my family uh, back in Illinois. I had to call them on the phone and tell them, I'm not gonna die from this. I'm just gonna have a hard time getting around from time to time. Well, I didn't really get a chance to, to spend any time in denial. I, I accepted this disease pretty quickly. I was blowing off my life. I wasn't really following through on anything, didn't accomplish any of the goals that I really wanted to. Then when MS came along, it was, it was an epiphany in itself because all of a sudden I got real urgent about what I could do. MS affects one side more than it does the other side. I started losing a little bit of my uh, fine sensitivity sensation in my fingers. I started to change songs into different tunings so that I could go from two and three finger chords to one and two finger chords. And if you watch a little bit on my hand, it's almost all one finger chords. When it's hard, he tells us. When he maybe can't play that day, he'll tell us. I could never do this with one hand and no capos. He doesn't try to deny it. He's written about it. It's come out in his music. Some of his music has, has a few dark songs um, because he's, he's so authentic with his pain. And he does pain. He does, he, he does suffer. He doesn't try to hide that from any of us. Certainly not from himself. Come home to a fire that's always warm. Come home to shelter from the storm. Come home to hugs and kisses sweet. Come home to this place of love we meet. Sound great. My art is music. The actual making of art for me is some healing. Have passed, some have it just pulls me through. It pulls me through. I can't say that it's made me a message better, but being able to do it still love. has made me feel a higher quality of life. Look just like that scooter helps me found. get around. If you're going to have music we all helping know people get into a healing bound. place, I think it's the most gratifying thing that you could possibly do with it. Some of Bill's songs are about his stiff hands and frail legs. They're songs that communicate what it's like for him to live with MS. It's certainly enlightening for us, the audience, but for Bill, the process of creating music is what's healing. Writing and performing music not only pulls Bill out of his immediate concerns, but it also restores his soul.